What's up, y'all? Welcome back to a new vlog. Well, today is Friday and we are outside. We is in the streets. I'm gonna go find some shoes for this child here because school is getting ready to start in like three weeks. Like, what? Didn't we just get in summer? Let me go in Claire's because I've never been in Claire's in like a long, long time. <laughs> up and I scraped my arm oh my gosh I, oh Jesus yeah so um, we're going into Ross I haven't been in Claire's in like I don't know how long I am Claire's ain't what it used to be with things used to be affordable I Like she put a seven and a half and her toe is literally at that edge. What in the world? How you skip like two, three whole sizes? That's crazy. Only thing that I don't like about Super Ross is the shoes are out. All right, y'all, so I made it back. We went to a couple of stores because really I was looking for my kids some shoes. Um, I'm gonna show you what kind of shoes that I did buy her. I'm gonna show you what I got at Bell's Outlet. So these are the shoes that I got at Bell's Outlet. They was only like $17. They was giving for, uh, a dupe look of forces, but that's what we got for her. And then we went to Marshall's where we got these black, all black Skechers. Cause they pretty much all purpose shoes that she could wear currently now. Like with anything, well, we gotta run to the store, she could throw them on. Go to the, uh, we go to the theme parks, she could throw them on. And then these her school, school shoes. We found these um, Jordans at, and they was only $50 though. They were $49.99, but I think I got a discount on them. So they were actual, actually uh, $34.99 for these. So these are the shoes that um, we got for her for school. We went to Pizza Hut. I got a personal pan pizza, and then I just got like a medium uh pepperoni and sausage pizza that's in there they eating on that but this what i got this i wanted me like with bell peppers onions. i want the mushrooms i wanted something different than that because they eat that all the time when we do order pizza so i'm switching it up for me and this is what i'm eating for dinner so yeah i'm gonna eat this i'm gonna take a shower give the boys a bath and call it a night hmm. what's up everybody welcome back to another vlog oh it's not another vlog i'm tacking this on to yesterday but i went and got my hair done who is she i'm actually starting the process of regrowing my hair back out i wanted to do like a pixie cut to kind of like see how i would look with it i'm okay with it and everything but i prefer growing my hair back out so i'm heading back home or we're just gonna try to chill today and then tonight me and my husband are going out to a restaurant we'll show you guys the atmosphere the food what the price is looking like what you know what i mean what the service is looking like and feeling like so i can let y'all know on these food finds here in orlando two hours later hey everybody uh it's now a couple of 
hours like it's been some hours um me and my husband are getting ready we're actually going out we're gonna go out to dinner we're going out to this place called tibby's new orleans kitchen we're gonna try the one in winter park and see how the food is how the vibe is Just trying to finalize my hair because i had tied up so but i got that green dress on okay i didn't wear the sneaker i wound up wearing my louis vuitton bag again because i love this bag and then i'm i got on some sandals so so we made it to the place so we're going to tibby's new orleans kitchen Ooh, it's hot out here oh you say it's a movie theater right there you can sit outside. Look at that. Pretty nice. That's good. That is 
so good. It's so vibrant in here. I mean, like, everybody's so cool in here. It's literally giving a New Orleans vibe. I love it. Hey, he brought us another sample, y'all. And this is the jambalaya. Oh my gosh, she is spoiling us. Let's try. Ooh, that big piece of sausage right there. Look at that. Let's see. Let's see. Oh my God. Mm. Mm. And I get this all the time at Universal Mardi Gras. I get they jambalaya there. But this right here tops this. This is like authentic. Authentic. Yeah. I'm going to have to leave the description information in below, y'all. Y'all got to eat at Tibby's. And if you have eaten at Tibby's, like, what are y'all eating? Because we going to come back and we might try those items that y'all been eating. This right here, this slaps. This slaps. Look, that's the gumbo that we tried. And that's the jambalaya, but that we tried. That's what that looked like. But this is the half and half po' boy. We got catfish and we got shrimp. I'm gonna show y'all. Turn it around. This the shrimp, oh boy. And then this the catfish. Some fries. <laughs> you better eat this. Oh, he done brought some jambalaya rice to try with the gumbo. <laughs> What you think? It's good, man. Oh my yeah, God! He's been good. bringing us. He's been bringing us the hitters. He's been bringing us the hitters. Oh, I know what the jambalaya, right? So he gave us some, didn't he? Mm -hmm. This Cajun rice. Oh no, that's Cajun rice. Oh, this was jambalaya. Okay, like the. He said try it with the jumbo stuff. Mm. Yeah, I'm not a spicy eater, and that's the Cajun rice, and it is it is spicy, but it does set off a way better flavor with that gumbo that he did. I'm telling y'all, y'all better come here. You better not bring nothing else out. That's all I got to say. Right, he's been bringing us out like sample after sample after sample, and Brian, I kid you not, said, Brian told me some. Oh, I just kind of want to get a little sampler. And he must have overheard that. And he's been bringing us that sample left and right, left and right. I'm trying to tell y'all, this is the service is great. The atmosphere great. The food is delicious. I mean, beyond delicious. Yeah, I'm going to put the information below, y'all. Y'all need to come to Tibby's. Well, this is the damage, y'all. <laughs> it was that good. And shout out to Jermaine. Shout out to him because he was the one who kept, he was the manager and he kept bringing us, why don't you try this, why don't you try that, why don't you try this, Jermaine, Jermaine with a G, okay, shout out to him because he hooked us up, best experience we done had, as far as restaurants go, they got one out in Br Bradenton or Brandon, one here in Winter Park and then another one in Altamont, so it's three locations some beignets to go. I'll show y'all what those look like.